Hello everyone, welcome to Coral Gables. Coral Gables, one of the most beautiful suburbs in Florida. Very affluent area. One of the richest parts of Miami. Beautiful area. I mean, architecture, landscaping, culture. This is where I would live if I was totally loaded. And I just checked on rental properties. And I can't even afford rent here. <laughs> Like a, a, a one bedroom apartment here is $3,000. Yeah. That's a little steep. Man, this is so pretty. But what a beautiful place. I do like place. the house too. This place is gorgeous. Like if, if I was a millionaire, this is where I would live. Mm -hmm. To be honest with you. Like this is, look at these stag horns. It's just downright one of the most beautiful places in, in the state of Florida. If not the United States. And it is ex expensive puppy. You're not gonna make it. High incomes, high real estate values. This is where there you go. Where'd you folks take their poop down? Right? Could you give me like remember that thing that told you the nationalities? Like what was it called? US data or something? I was looking at property values at the oh, moment. Look at that you. you can get like a regular house here for around what you can find in our area. 750? Less, like six. Oh, really? 640, you're getting a like 1200 square foot house. Like nice houses here in Coral Gables. You're talking about communities of golf courses, and I think the property taxes are insane here too. I could look at the property taxes don't on this. Worry, don't even worry about it. Look up the demographics. Remember that thing we had where I gave you like, the nationalities? Wow, dude, this is so beautiful. Property taxes is like $5,000 a year. Yeah, it's not cheap. And there's a Cuban around here. And it's not just you. That wasn't nice. How I know how you feel when I see mean things about American sea potatoes. Kinda hurt. First, I can't read your lips, so I don't know if you're angry. She's like lipping stuff. I'm like, I can't read your lips. She's just like lip making lip motions and shaking her fist. Oh, I can write it all down for you. I don't need you to write it. I need to find that dang demographics like I asked. I'm you getting it for you, but that website isn't working. Your mother isn't working. Excuse you? I'm sorry. Go on, woman, swing if you're going to do it. Apparently, that website is down. So, so we're going to go with the U.S. Census Bureau. Oh. Look at how beautiful this one is. Santa Maria. Santa Maria. 57% H. 3.2% A. 72% W. Man, this is gorgeous out here. Let's see if I can show you guys the houses real quick. Excuse me. You know a lot of houses in Old Naples look like this? Like yes. the older houses in Old Naples? Yes. Like I don't have money and I'm already wanting to live like this. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that website is down. I don't know why. I don't know why it's down. Because I need to it's look at it. It's not Cuban. If it was Cuban, it'd be working. What's wrong with you? Hey. That's not right. Neither is what your people did to the Native Americans. <laughs> I didn't do anything. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, bro. Relax. I literally have done nothing. It's all. <laughs> Kids, like, I have not done anything to know, but I wouldn't even do something like that. 
Does he actually have to go inside people's houses to give them the mail? Wow, that's fancy. And it's why their property taxes are so expensive. Dude, this is like... If I live in a place like this, I want a maid. Wow. You know what? You are my maid. No, because it's a lot of house and I don't want to spend my whole life cleaning it. Don't get a house as big. Yeah. We're not technically even in Italian. We're, um, we're not even in... Coral Gables, technically. We're just on the outskirts. Mm -hmm. We're not even in Coral Gables yet. We're just like on the outskirts of Man, this is how I would spend my millions. This is how I would spend my millions. I would spend my millions here. Where would you spend your millions, Katie? Michigan. But yes, here. I can't believe that even came out here. Well, maybe in the summer we'd go up to Michigan. Yeah. I'm with you on that. I want to go to Michigan soon. I was learn. describing Michigan to someone last night. In yeah. Detroit. They're like, do they have Cubans? That wasn't what they asked. <laughs> She's explaining the Cubans what Michigan's like. They're like, do they have Cuban coffee? Oh, I yeah. know. I know going, Poppy. <laughs> Katie explained the I Cubans. I was like, there's food from all over the world. It's really good. I was like, you know how Miami has Latin? Well, there's like everything, like Mediterranean. Oh, like what I type of Cuban is that? That is not what they said. <laughs> the only one who's backwards is you. <laughs> Ow! Are you happy now that you've bit me? Yeah. Okay. I'm glad you're happy. So, what are you eating today? Well, you want to eat y'all ready? I hate that. I would rather just be on the beach right now and we have to come over here and do these videos in these uh -huh. pretty looking areas for these people. I want like... Dang it, people. I want like good... Good, good Cuban food. Well, this area is called Italian Village. Mm -hmm. Like, something so much Cuban grandma would make. So good. You know what I mean? Mm. I like that cafeteria style stuff. Where you go I don't like cafeteria Cuban places. I love it. I like the idea of ordering exactly what you want and having it made by a Guatemalan. That's not what I like. I want to have my good tamale. I'm not a fan of cafeterias. I don't I, want I, like I despise, chain. Those like cafeteria cooking places where like the food's already cooked and it's just thrown on the plate. What am I, a horse? But it's always the best. I don't think it's a bad thing. You order your food, somebody makes it, and you eat it. But then they have the good tamales and they had the buen apple and they <laughs> just a buen apple. <laughs> I can't breathe. Where's my hair? She said buen apple. <laughs> oh yeah, puppy. She said buen apple instead of buen I don't think they understand Spanish. I'm sure there's somebody sitting inside the house drinking tea like, this neighborhood's going to crop. <laughs> you said bunny apple. So? <laughs> Why you don't, you? Even, you don't even know what Cuban food is, dude. You don't know how to say the names right. You're over here trying to argue with a Cuban about Cuban food. You don't know Why are you sad? So Why are you making me sad? You said bunny apple. So? You don't even know how to say it right. So, I like it. Boniato. Say it with me, Poppy. Boniato. <laughs> the No, Henry. I'm sorry. You already bit me earlier. 
That should be enough. What about fishing? Or beaching? I, I feel like a beach day. 90 degree weather on Saturday is a beach day. Oh, snap. US 1 over here. Wow, what the crap is that? It is Asian. The car. Still. Ferrari. Ferrari. Look at that Hummer. What the crap? It's for sale. Is it really? Yeah. Dude, that is like so gangster. Mm -hmm. I do like how there's. I'm on I like how there's trees here, but yet the houses are good size. This is beautiful. This is what I like. It's basically what I can afford. Hey, Katie. So, what was that Cuban thing you wanted to eat? Boniato. No. Oh, the peacock. She's chasing the peacock. Boniato. She's like angry at it. Look at how beautiful that, that bird is. I Fitch. hope it spreads its feathers. It was like she was like running it off her own and I stuff. I want to see the feathers. I like the feathers. He thought that man you are silly. A bird. Papi, you making me late to work. You you put that problem with the cross of the eye, Papi. You see this guy? Ah! Es la guaparilla. You don't make it spray his feathers. In Cuba, I knew. Yo, in Cuba, I used to practice Taekwondo, Papi. You don't want this. Do you see this guy screaming at me, Papi? He's gonna spray his feathers. His feathers. Do you think I'm uncivilized? Completely, they take your, they went inside their house. <laughs> Peacocks will scream at you? Yes, and they'll also fight you. Were they really? Yeah. I was just about to get beat up by a peacock? Yeah. How did it know I was being aggressive? I love how animals know when you're aggressive to the hostile. Yes. That's the type of place I would like. Surrounded by trees. No, I want people to see my house so they know I have a lot of money. I want shade trees. So you're telling me peacocks are aggressive? Yes, they can be. How come the lady like just like kicked it off her front lawn and it was cool for she her? She didn't touch it. She like catch it. She like kicked it off her front lawn. She's like, bad that. Those Americans are like, why did we move here? <laughs> this place is so uncouth. Le Jung Ro, this is Le Jung. All right, let's go back to, to the peacock. The peacocks are aggressive, really? Yeah. I have no idea. Yeah. Why are they screaming at me? I think it's chasing us. Where is it? Not sure. It's like chasing our car. Where is it? It remembered me and came back for me. Where is it? I don't know. They, I don't know if peacocks would scream at people. Yeah. They I scream can hear at people? it, but I can't see it. Peacocks scream at people? They can. Huh. Why would you have an animal that's aggressive in your front lawn? They don't want to. That house is gorgeous. I mean, they have them here. Wow, this place is beautiful. Uh-huh. Probably multi-million dollar. Oh, yeah, there's no doubt about it. There's a two million dollar house out here. Hummer on 30s. And it's for sale. Yeah. They probably went way too much when they went to the work and put a specific sign for it. Yeah. Okay. So peacocks will attack you? Yeah. Okay, that goes on. Now, apparently they can sense hostility from all the way. Yeah. What the I went to Cuba, I went to a Cuban bakery with Jose and they he told okay. me it was cu too Cuban. He didn't like it because it was too Cuban. So Maybe it was too Cuban. What the crap is up with this? I don't go to restaurants and say, oh, this is too American. I do all the time. Remember when I we went to Indiana? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't do that. I don't do that. You don't do that. You just don't do that. That's weird. You just don't do that. It's food. But wait, there's no beef. I don't discriminate when it comes to food other than things I'm allergic to, which... You kind of can't have to do, so. Oh! Oh, he's still going to go. He's still going. It'd be nice if you had used your turn signal from the beginning. Yeah. And not 
park on people's lawns. It's in your job to keep their lawns pretty enough to park on them. Yeah, pretty much. I like that. Why would you have an animal that's aggressive running around your neighborhood? Multiple. They have flocks of them. Because it's a symbol of prestige. Having an aggressive bird on your front lawn is a symbol of prestige. We have to get yeah. some. Well, not, not not where we live right now, but eventually we can. At least in Miami. You have to live in Miami to do that. If you have... If you're poor, then you get chickens. Yeah. It's a symbol of poverty. Yes, that's pretty much what I figured out from the Miami area. Wow, man, look at those properties, boats behind them. <sighs> what are you mad about? I don't know. I just felt like doing that. Okay. I don't know, even try to understand you anymore. Try to stay away from me when you're angry. Yes. Because I get crazy. What the crap is up with just smear mark on my wrist? Is that is she holding a child or is that her hair? Her oh, it's a child. I, I couldn't tell if it was her hair or a child when she was holding. So it's like where the windshield wiper stops, there's like a bunch of muck build up. What if I clean? Yeah. It's making my video look like crap. Dude, this is like <laughs> If I was loaded, there's no doubt this is where yeah. I would have a house. Right here. Yeah. I would agree with that statement. And it's not too expensive. That's only a few million dollars. Not really. Yeah, it is. Depends on where you're at. Yeah, these have canals. Yeah. Well, yeah, we've got canals. Don't be expensive. We get a 2,000 square feet for a house. Look at limestone gates around the houses. Look at the freaking trees going through the limestone. They're so cool. They have a tree growing on rocks. Naples ain't got nothing on this, bro. You can get a really, really, really nice house for a million dollars with a pool. Like, That's it? Yeah. Huh. Not bad. With the pool. That's it? Just a million? Less than a million. Oh, wow. Right in our price range. We're in the less than a million price range. Yes. <laughs> That's a fancy way of saying we're broke. We're in yeah. the less than a million price range. I'm classy enough to live in a place like this. Eventually. Look at this person. They have like hundreds of statues on their front lawn. Mm -hmm. You think that's classy? Not in the least bit. There's a place called Venetian Gardens here that's pretty fancy. I think that's what it's called. It's like a... I think you can pay and go there by the way. Venetian Pools I think it's called. Yeah. Yeah, stop it. I did not bring my baby shoes. I should have, but I didn't. Look, baby, look how pretty. Look how pretty. Gorgeous. I think you will. Work. Work. Now, hitting me to work is not going to... might have worked in the 1800s, but it's not going to work today, Katie. We're not in the 1800s. You can't just hit somebody and make them work. I can't believe you even think about doing that. Please don't hit me and tell me to work ever again. I guarantee I'm going to take a one-way vacation next time you do it. You're not going to come with me, honey. <laughs> the notion that for you, 
exploiting me was the first thing that came to your mind. Wow, Katie. <laughs> That's really your first idea was exploiting me, really? Well, I didn't want to be the one to do it. That's why you're never going to get it. I'll get it, though. No, you won't. Yeah, well. No, you won't. You're not dedicated enough. Oh, we're heading south. Crap. Around here I don't know. I found where we're at. Beautiful guy. I didn't know. I don't know. Yeah, we're definitely not trying to go south. If anyone's wondering why this? I'm acting I'm weird, it's because I purposely turned my brain off. So, yeah. This guy recording stuff? Yeah. Go with no. the city! That's a child, Jose. Oh. And a white child, that. Yeah. I did not understand that. Alright. Well, I try to communicate with him. Even your, even your white, even your Cuban at that age is not gonna good reply back to that. Why not? It's good vocabulary. Yeah. Uh, at that point, they've they don't do that. Yeah, I don't got a boat. <sighs> what I eat in a day. Someone might be interested in what I actually eat in a day. Take me to downtown uh, Coral Gables. Downtown? Yeah. You're like in Ponce Davis. That's cool. We're close. We're in the area. It doesn't matter. Close enough. I hate when people are like, but yeah, you have to be within. So you don't have to be anywhere. Do whatever I want, Bobby. In a quarter mile, at the traffic circle, take the second exit onto Southwest 42nd Avenue, South Lejeune Road. Lejeune. 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 Google needs to fix their stuff. Yeah, they yeah. can say La Jolla, but they can't say La Yun. La Yun, mija. La Yun. Where does this Cuban anger come from? Mine? Yeah, also you just became an anger Cuban. I'm gonna go this way. I, I don't use the filter that I usually use on my brain, and I'm just trying to. Let it out. Yeah. Be yourself. You'll feel happy. Yeah, I, I, I've already feeling happier already. Dude, this is absolutely gorgeous out here. Turn right. Up along here. In three miles. Up along here. Up along here. Wash me. Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah. Eats their Why would you do that? Look at that limestone house. That is so cool. My son. Bang, bang. My son. Bang, bang. There's trees here. But it's still Miami. But there's trees. Yeah. I like trees. Wow, look at the size of those things. <sighs> I'm lonely. Mm -hmm. Naples ain't crap compared to this. Yeah. Demographics on this place. 
I can't even use the Democrat. There you have it. Population. How many people live here? Where are they? What the demographics are? I did it when you were in the middle, but I'll do it again. Forty-eight thousand people here. There is 3% B, 3% A, 57% H, and... 57% Hispanic? Yes, and 34% W. Wow. So there's more Hispanics than whites out here. Yeah. And two or more. Well, I thought it was Hispanic area referred to before. Nineteen. Yes. I thought it was Hispanic area referred to before. What's wrong with you? I'm from Alabama. Oh look, a Bentley. You yes. know it's not poor. If they're Bentleys. <laughs> what the crap is that? 19% mixed. Road. When you cross this road, it just goes crazy. Jose! Huh? 19% mixed. Yeah, you have a lot of Cubans that are mixed with whites. Yeah. Like, kind of like our age. Yeah. They, yeah, they have a lot of mixed. Mm -hmm. How? I can't believe this is actually here. Uh, computer and internet use, 97% of the population. Well, what do you think? <laughs> We know how to read. We know how to use a computer. <laughs> Yo, Cadillac, I'm 22. Medium income for media income is 113,000 per capita income in the last 12 months, 71,623. Nice. That's twice what I made this year. After all my hotel write-offs. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'd have to double my income to live here. Yeah. It's doable. Maybe in a few years, but not right now. It's not going to happen tomorrow. No. I'll do that much. No. Everything comes in time. Except for you getting a job. That's been a while. Oh, uh, yeah. Good apartments? things come with time. Are these apartments here? Don't seem to have parking. No. They're condos. Condominios. Condominios. What, what's wrong? Come on, I'll give, I'll give you a hug. You need a hug.
phone from getting too hot. There we go. The camera keeps tilting at an angle. It's starting to aggravate me. It's like it doesn't want to go straight. saw a picture from traffic on a mountain road yesterday. It looked like something out of like Los Angeles. Yeah. I'm so glad we left Naples. <laughs> Every year I see like stuff with Naples and I'm like I'm so glad I left Naples. Form today. I know. I, I, I have purposely shut off and let the impulsiveness out. Yeah. Phone call, huh? You calling? Hey, what up, Slickback? Yeah, that's what I said, Slickback. Can I just call you Slick Back for short? Let me just call you Slick Back. No, I'm not deaf. You think it's a chronic dependency? Are you sure about this? Are you sure I should do this? Mr. A Pimp Name Slick Back? Oh, sorry about the mystery. Okay, no mystery. Just, just a pimp named Slickback. Okay. All right. Are you sure I should do this? No, it hasn't been working. But in 600 feet, turn right onto Coral Way, Miracle Mile. <laughs> I don't think I need advice from someone like you. <laughs> the white girl's all burnt up. <laughs> oh, yeah, she looks like a tomato, Mr. A Pimp Named Slickback. Yeah, she's all burnt up. You should have seen this thing. Yeah, Miami. No, that's not what I'm doing. I'm just here with my wife. Yes, I'm taking her on vacation. You don't think she should be on vacation? Your grandma's calling you? Okay, she's not. She's supposed to be on. on okay, I'm going to let you go. Sounds like you got a lot going on. All right, a pimp named Slickback. Thank you. Bye. Slickback home. On my phone? Okay. Yeah. Who's that? Slickback. He's a pimp. Why are you friends with pimps? He's counseling me. Why? He's teaching me how I should treat a woman. Why? He does marriage counseling. He doesn't sound like he's right. doing that. Oh, but pero, pero, pero te voy a quitar esos pesos, mija. That's how Lisa's like on the street corner holding money. Because she's waiting for the bus. She's waiting for her pimp. Or her bus. Te di bolas a matar a son. Sí. <laughs> 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 That is so entitled. Like she's fat. She, that's why she's fat. What's going on here? Why is it every time we come to Coral Gables, there's an event on time? I don't know what's going on. Every time we come here, there's a salsa music event on time. Why am I angry about this?
How the crap is Javier with her fat butt is gonna sit there, see a police car going to emergency, and she's too important to move her fat butt. That's why she's fat, because she won't move her fat butt. Fat women. It does not say it's a vet. Okay. Let's just do this every week in here. <laughs> How the crap you're gonna see a police officer that's going to an emergency and she didn't move her fat butt at all. She was just like, nah, that's why she's so fat. She's, she won't move. No la panza que tiene, por eso está todo panzuda porque no se quita de medio. Yeah, but police officers coming, they has a right away. To Get out of the situation. way! How are you gonna like walk yourself patiently, like you're so, like you're you're just that important, you know? Like, how stuck up do you have to be? Move, just it's not gonna hurt you to like sedoodle for like twenty feet and get a crap out of the cops' way, man. Her fat, overweight. I can't stand fat women. You can't stand me? No, not you, baby. You're you would have rushed. I think you'd have more sense than to sit there and hog up a cop's thing. Yeah. Carnival. That would make a great short. A carnival. Say it's carnival. Carnival. Okay. carnival. Not interesting carnivals. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I don't do carnivals. People don't realize that carnivals, there's a meaning behind carnivals. Look it up. It's actually like a religious thing. Learning about it. Yeah. yeah. There's a whole like context to carnivals. Mm -hmm. People think carnival's just a party. Like It's actually like a religious celebration. It actually has like a context to it because people don't know what it's about. It's not my thing. I'm glad they're out here having a good time, but it's not for me. Yeah. Tienes que mover la banderita. La banderita tienes que like, you have to scream at them. If they're, you gotta scream at them. Sorry? You gotta scream at them. Like wave the flag and scream, you know? Yes. Yes. Because you know, se quita en el medio. You know? <laughs> That's how I ended up at that Martin Luther King parade in Miami. I had no idea what they were doing. I just, yeah. like, I just saw a bunch of people outside. The next thing I know, I was celebrating Martin Luther King's birthday. Mm -hmm. Not on purpose. Yeah. Is that normal? Candle coffee roasters. That's oh, yeah, I'm going to get to the table. Oh, my gosh. 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 No, no. Tú, tú sabes que a mí me metí una pilla de peso para guapería. Para que entonces venga una jeva aquí con un celular está agitando más seres. Y en cura médico. Y prestigioso. Y no médico de gente, de animales. Y no estaban vivos, estaban muertos. Era un carnicero, pero es que hace lo mismo. Es about the same thing, bro. This car just blew a red light in front of a cop. Yeah. They're guiding them, right? They're guiding them. I love how Miami you can like vibe with cops, man. You're just like, oh, yeah. my mom, I don't want like this. Can I blow this red light? You can go. Can you go? Yeah. Then you gotta wait for the signal. No, you have to I go. Wait. Somebody's okay. gotta tell you to go. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. Oye, están guapos. Oye, se pajarito. Oye, se están fajando. Se están fajando. You gonna let them fight? You can't let the birds fight, Poppy. You're a cop. You have to stop this, man. Then. They don't, they're not respecting your authority, Poppy. That car just hit the curb. We'll have to wait. Yeah. Okay, I can go. All that tipo se me atravesó, man. Come on, man. I have a colonoscopy later. I'm late. I'm going to be late to my colonoscopy, man. Este tipo, I got to go to a colonoscopy se me atraviesa. <laughs> No, I'm not pitting you. Man, the cops are so cool. Anywhere else in America, you'd get beat upside the head for doing that. Yeah, I know. And one fat cop was awesome. Yeah. He was like talking to me in Cuba, like, "Oh no, man, what the hell are you doing? Is this guy hawking a horn at me again? Where are you late to? You have <sighs> it's carnival this time of year. Yeah. It's really carnival? Mm -hmm. Is that what it is? Yeah. I looked it out. It's carnival. 
like, just for Cubans or like, cause like I know it's big for all the Caribbean islands. Like, uh, I know it's big in Trinidad. Look at the bill, it's nice. It's a community event. Este tipo se this car out. is getting Dale, away from mijo. everyone. Yeah. Yeah. He needs to figure out where he's going. Make up your mind, Poppy. Yeah. This is how you're supposed to drive in Miami. Probably. What a beautiful city. Good Just makes hell. you want to scream at somebody randomly in traffic. Yes. I would enjoy living here too much. It's a problem. Uh, I would enjoy it too, and I would probably become more aggressive. <laughs> okay, what a beautiful. There's always something going on in this town. Yeah. Like, I've never been here, and there's not something. Like last time, there was a salsa festival. Yeah. And then, uh. There's some nice trees. That's a South African flag right there. There's all different types of trees and flags. I saw a Brazilian flag. Is that a blue? Look at that blue Lambo. Ooh, that's beautiful. That's pretty, man. DC Ferrari. I think we'll be back in Miami soon. Okay. Do you want to go Hialeah? Yeah, we have to go Hialeah. It's not really what I... I want to go to the beach, but I, it's like what I want to do and what I have to do are two things. Yes, that's usually... The beach videos never do that well in Miami. No, they don't. They, it's like the grimy hood crap they want to see. Yeah, we gotta go to Hialeah. Hialeah, man. Hialeah. Hialeah. Oh, Miami Springs stinks as much of. Uh, what was the word I was gonna say? Iguanas. Feral. They don't want to be part, they don't want to be associated with Hialeah. They're too savage, I guess. I think we're in Miami, though. Yes, we are. Yes, you can tell by the music that people are playing. I yeah. think if you were to play any type of music other than Spanish I think music, we're in Miami here. you'd probably not be well received. I said, my perfect. I think we're in Miami now. So. Once we cross this road, we'll be in Miami. Is it Street? Yeah, we're in Miami. Yes. Oh, we're in Air Street. All right, like, guys, so that's Coral yeah. Gables. We're now we're on the edge of Miami city limits. So that'll be a different video. We'll drive through Miami. And what I want to try to do is drive through like, I'll just switch phones too. Get your phone ready. Yeah. This phone's probably at the max with the, we got it on 4K. So yeah. all right, y'all check it out.